Hello, this is Eric at the Prince Short Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2020 Ford Edge in an ST trim and powered by a 2.7 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, providing you with plenty of power and excellent fuel efficiency with all-wheel drive capabilities, so you're going to be able to get around pretty well in the changing weather conditions. But let's take a look inside. Your cargo area, which is pretty spacious and can always be expanded by folding down the rear seats, and you have controls to do so from back here with a 12-volt power outlet, and underneath this cover you have your spare tire and some large compartments for extra storage and this closes again with another simple press of a button then looking into the back seat where you have comfortable seating for three with a nice leather and suede interior fold-out armrest with two cup holders in the middle and a USB or sorry a 12 volt and 110 volt power outlet down there this vehicle does have a remote start so no need to go outside on those cold mornings to warm up your car Looking in, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as three memory buttons for your power adjustable driver's seat, steering wheel, and mirrors, as well as having a premium b &O sound system, so your audio is going to sound pretty decent. Now, sitting in the vehicle with it running, you can see it's sitting at 25,264 kilometers. And moving down to the steering wheel, on the right-hand side, you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, as well as your controls for your right screen, where you can cycle through your entertainment and phone controls. Moving on to the left, where you have your cruise controls, as well as your controls for your left screen, where you can cycle through your digital speedometer, all-wheel drive status, your turbo boost gauge, distance to empty, RPMs, RPMs in oil temperature, and tire pressures. And you can also go into your trip one and two information, fuel economy, driver assistance settings and features, and settings in general for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. Moving on, you do also have your lane keeping system on the end of your signal stock. And then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio series and Bluetooth capable, so you have some options there. You have your digital climate controls with dual zone front climate. Bluetooth phone controls, whatever apps you may have installed, and settings for your screen and some other features around your vehicle. You also have a heated steering wheel so you can keep your fingers warm. And shifting into reverse, you have a backup camera so you can see where you're going and hopefully avoid hitting anything. Moving down, you have your hazards and then your media, your physical media and climate controls, again with dual zone front climate, but also heated front seats. Behind this panel, you have this sort of hidden cubby area, as well as a 12 volt power outlet in the passenger foot area. Then you have this compartment here with two USBs and a wireless charging pad. So if your phone is uh, compatible, throw it on there to charge. And then you have your main shifter on a dial, very convenient, but you do also have paddle shifters on the wheel so you can manually shift through your gears. Parking brake, two cup holders, slot for your phone or something like that, auto start stop shut off, another little cubby here, and then your center compartment slash armrest with a removable tray, ton of room inside with another 12 volt so you can plug something in from there too. And then last but not least, you do have a panoramic moonroof so you can let the sunshine. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.